if Puss in Boots villains were charged for their crimes. Hello, missus. We're looking for a cat. This cat. Make her talk. Excuse me, my darling. We're looking for the legendary Puss in Boots. Out with it, you old biddy, or I'll have your guts for garters. Throwing an old lady in a piano and playing it, making every string hit her in the face is one heavy assault charge. Also, they have wrecked the entire home. They must really like trespassing and wrecking up places. There are a lot of shrunken people on that ship, and she just wrecked the bottle, liberating them, but also hurting them, possibly. We will charge this with a reckless endangerment charge. You shouldn't have done that, mate. Yeah. <laughs> Telling you, when we get that wish, it will make everything just right for all of us. I will have to charge them for following puss everywhere. Thanks for the maps, of course. Delicious. The Serpent Sisters got the goods. A map to the wishing star. It took a lot of murdering to get this map. Jack hired criminals to get the map for him, which means he will be held responsible for the murdering. Yes, I collect enchanted objects, magical icons, and magic carpets. Sweet. The shrunken ship of the Lilliputians. The carpet is alive and nailed to the floor, and the entire boat is held captive. Baby unicorn horns, half as heavy, twice as sharp. 52 baby unicorn horns. I have no idea how he got them, but I think based on his character, we can speculate. About your payment. You promised us our weight in gold. I did, didn't I? Oh no, I misjudged the situation! Talking fairy tale. Animals! Ah! who tried to steal from me. Excalibur! Excalibur! <laughs> well, start chopping! On it! Fight this the wrong Jerry, go! Fetch me, Jeff! Aren't you gonna? These babies are gonna get me that wish even after the whole team is dead and gone. Jack doesn't care about his people and just lets them die. And he even plans for them to not survive. I will sentence this as murder based on the fact he just uses them as pawns meant to die. The noble phoenix. Pretty boss flamethrower. I really have my work cut out for me on this one. Or we'll see what the unicorn horn really does. Whoa. <laughs> what? Oh, you shot me! I got him, Mr. Order! My dad! Oh, no. All right, bring it over. Oh, oh, what took you so long, idiot? Bang, bang, bang! Oh, come on, you walked into that one! Mr. Hoyner, I need your help! Duly noted, but a little busy at the moment! 
That was weird. already! You could say death is stalking puss, causing him anxiety attacks, etc. But the thing is, death is just doing his job, so he is allowed to do those things. You! I do love the smell of fear. I'm death. Straight up. Why don't I do us both a favor and take this last one? That's kidding! As Gambler, past live puss says, death is cheating at his job and Death agrees by doing the shushimote. But since there are no rules surrounding his job, he can do whatever he wants, I guess. We will give him a warning. They're coming for me. Just get me over this wall. We gotta go. Help me up the wall. Get me off the wall. Hurry! <laughs> Hurry! Humpty robs a bank, he is still a minor. But being almost mature, he will be charged in regular adult court and get a 20-year sentence. Given Beanstalk Chapter 14, Giant takes a big dirt nap. Ah! Ankle burn. Ah! My sweet darling. <laughs> She's mine now! <laughs> no, don't fly, little goblin! Fly! Good night, Humpty. <laughs> it's a surprise party, and the surprise is on you. Look, spent a lot of time in a prison preparing for this. You think this was all about getting the gold and, and clearing your name? Revenge. But I was always there. Sweetie, let's uh, get out of here before Mama shows up. See, the Mama's on her way, and when she gets here, it's bye bye San Ricardo and everything you ever cared about. <laughs> Humpty had a master plan to unleash the beast onto San Ricardo. The entire city gets damaged, and some get clearly killed. This is a terrorism charge. We have no rooms. Well, I think one just opened up. <laughs> We'd like a complimentary continental breakfast. And don't even think about skimping on them baby muffins. We don't have any baby muffins. <laughs> Jack and Jill destroy the hotel bell and are intimidating the hotel man. They will get a restraining order and will have to replace the little bell. Oh! 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 Oh!
<laughs> is it true a cat always lands on its feet? No! That is just a rumor spread by dogs! Hanging Puss from a cliff and forcing him to obey is coercion. Just eggs. So how about you give us that goose?